morning. How's it going? I hope it's going well for you. It is us. Uh, got a lot going on, but Facebook is our connection to you to let you know what's going on in our in our store. What it takes to make a small business grow and go. It also lets you know what's on our website. We have some great promotions all the time on our website. I've got lots to tell you today. Um, we are getting ready for our new Queen Bee Club, the new design for the month. Uh, we're, we will send you your free design. Uh, I've got it picked out. It's in my bag. But you'll learn as the day goes on what, what we're into right now, the next three or four weeks. But please like us, share us. You know, uh, we focus on the latest names. If you put your name in, when we started our Facebook, like us, share us, you're likely not to be picked because we go for the ones who's most recent. So you got to like us and you got to share us weekly. Uh, and we get a form. Mary has us a form. And we usually tell Scott to pick a number one to whatever. And our new winner this week is my good friend, Patty Rockwell. You know, I've got Patty working on something at home uh, new, and I think all of you guys are going to like it. Uh, it's a little challenging, she said, but at some point she'll get it to me. So Patty Rockwell is our winner this week. She gets a $20 gift certificate. You've got to use it online just so you know. Now, the first thing I want to share with you, you say, well, um, I'm going to run back to the Queen Bee design. This is our kit. It has everything in it with the medium tear away, which you can see, and we've wrote on the, the stabilizers in each kit. These are all the fabrics that you will need to achieve this. Now, is that cute? And... This is where you can stick stuff. Um, a lady that just bought a new embroidery machine said she'd take it to the beach and she'd put her book, but she wouldn't put a pillow in it. She'd put uh, her towel and stuff in it. So there's many different uses for this, or if it's a kid or just a friend, you know, maybe it's going through chemo or whatever, this would be a great gift. And we also have the pillows in stock. Um, this is the pillow, the, the pillow form. And then in the kit, you get this, this, and you get the felt to be able to do this. I had to look. It's felt in this kit in small pieces, but this is everything that you need to do it. And plus, you go to Kimberbell to get your design. They don't let us do it early, so you, you know, so there's no way. I can send your design to you or you can go on and get it because that's just what they've decided to do this year. So go on uh, tomorrow morning, say after 10, and you should be able to get it. And if you have questions, uh, Lori will probably send a free design out today. So we wanted to share it with you first. Uh, the kit, this kit's $9.99 because there's more fabric person has to cut it, you guys. I pay them to do it. I hope you take advantage of the kits because we are pre-cutting uh, just 10 to 12 kits per design because, um, I don't know, some of you like to choose your own fabric and I'm okay with that, but I make life easy for the ones who want to do it and make it look great. So, a pillow forms, matter of fact, I'm just going to mention this and I'll mention it again. Today is one of our weekly um, deals. I'm trying to save you a few dollars where I can, just so you know. Now, you can't order the pillow form at the 25% off and then go and do another sale because that's double couponing us. So, Shopify won't let you do it. So, if there's any question that you want, you would have to do two separate orders. And if you're a shipping kind of girl that we have to ship to, do one as pickup and store, and then one uh, for shipping. Now, I'm smart enough to figure that out, but if I have questions, or Lori does, we'll give you a call. 
Now, you say, what's going on at the sewing gallery? <laughs> I wanted to show you what I do. Jill and I, we are the only two that touch these dresses. Uh, I've got a couple more in the back, but I'm not bringing them up. But I just wanted to show you um, what we do here besides quilting, sewing, classes, promoting Camberville, promoting brother. Uh, Embroidery, it, monogram. Embroidery, <laughs> monogramming. Thank you, Lori. These dresses are very expensive, and, uh, you know, we're on our search for a new person, but new people don't touch these. Old people don't touch these either. <laughs> <laughs> and what I mean by old people is people that's been here a while because um, I try to make sure... I do them. This fine tunes me. This takes me to a level with different needles. If you'll look, we're, we're working with different textures. Hand sewing a lot of this. We're taking, you know, I have not been a fan of these hands. I don't know what designer came out with it, uh, but all it does is to catch stuff. So we're taking this hem off, hem and these, taking them up. Girl came back twice for this one. This one has a split all the way up to here. But what bothered me about this dress is she's 14 years old. I think it needs to be closed in. It's almost at her hip. But I just wanted to show you uh, the stress level that I get under during prom time. Uh, I talked to one of my reps and I said, she said, what have you been doing? I says, it's prom time. And she says, no, our prom's not until May. Well, folks bring these dresses in early, and I thank them so very much because there's a lot of work to these. And uh, this is one we're just cutting the inner layers. This dress right here has 10 layers. So a lot of times people buy these dresses off of Facebook and stuff, and they're saving money, but yet it's going to cost them to be up with alterations. But a 10-layer dress... I would probably charge you at least a hundred to a hundred and fifty dollars to him. It that's ten layers, and that kills Jill's back and kills mine too. But I'm just basically taking the waist up in this one. Um, we've got dresses that are due out in a couple of weeks, and these are just a few of what you will be seeing. So um, this style of dress seems to be huge because I've got it in purple, blue, and red. So that's kind of where fashion is going this year. Uh, we're not doing a lot of beading. So I just wanted to give you an insight because when it comes to the fashion world, trust me, I know it because I do alterations. And when it comes to needles, um, I've had to search out Jill and I. Jill helps me prep them and then I try to sew them. And then we for, force Lori or whoever's working the front to maintain the front because um, the focus, and you should know that when you're piecing or doing anything, you can't run into the kitchen and boil the spaghetti and come back and do that one-fourth inch seam good. So, you know, your focus. And um, during this time, my neck is so challenged. Yesterday, I, I left out of here and my neck was killing me. I've got a dress on the table. There's two back there. Well, there's probably three to four more that we haven't showed you, but I wanted to show you what we do. We, you know, sewing as a owner of a small business is a serious matter, and I love it, and I'm serious about it. And whether it's sewing on clothes or sewing a quilt, quilting your quilt, um, I take it very serious. And, uh, Sometimes we have to talk it out and think about it. Uh, Lori, Jill, and I, I mean, Betsy, uh, when she was here, uh, we don't really know what's happening with Betsy other than she's got a boot. So we just want to shout out and hope that you're doing well, Betsy. But this is an intense time for me as a sewer. So uh, they say, when was the last quilt you made? And I want to say to y'all, when was the last prom dress that you tried to do? And I want to give you one more example of, of a dress. Lori, if you want to pull it over here. 
when you look at a hem, this is how big this hem is. That's a 30 minute hem. That's not counting the time that it took to cut it off, which Jill cut it off. And then we have several layers underneath the crinolines. And then we have an inside layer. So, you know, uh, it's, um, it's sometimes a little overwhelming. But I just wanted to show you, uh, I love taking on the challenge to see if I've got what it takes. And many folks says, are you going to stop taking dresses? Well, we don't. Unless you're that little rich girl that left your gown in the car for two weeks because you just didn't think about it or it wasn't important to you because you didn't respect whoever does the alterations. But if you're a person that uh, mom and dad has to wait until that last paycheck to be able to pay for the alterations because they put the dress in layaway in January, I'm going to take care of you because the working people, this, these are costly dresses. I bet you know, this one I know was used, but she bought it for $100, which she got a great deal. But, you know, uh, a lot of parents don't have the money to put it out up front, so they have to wait. And, you know, a lot of people are living paycheck to paycheck. So I try to take care of the customer that is out there working, paying these great taxes. So we just wanted to share with you what's going on at Sun Gallery. And in the meantime... We're still quilting, we're still doing regular alterations, we're still serving you at the be to the best of our ability that we can. We're still promoting wonderful machines from Brother. And you know, I sew with nothing else but a Brother machine. Uh, when I am doing dresses like this, there's no way I would want to be on a low-end machine. Mm -hmm. Because the user-friendly of a Brother machine uh, the capabilities of a larger machine that, that you can use. So, you know, some people says, I just want to spend $500 on a machine because I do alterations. Shame, shame on you. You haven't thought the game through. Um, whatever business that you do, whether it's sewing, you become a hairdresser, because I'm familiar with that, you have to invest money into it. So that didn't cost you anything to give you that little bit of information about being in business for yourself but we love doing it it's the challenge for Jill and I and uh, we don't talk a lot when she's trying to figure out these dresses a lot of these dresses have the Trump uh, backing and they want to leave it as much as possible and then these glitter dresses has to be hand sewn you can't use a machine for these because you would mess up uh, lots of needles, and you just shouldn't. It's hard on the machine. Okay, the next thing we're going to talk about is the table toppers. We, uh, from Raleigh Blake, we still have a few of our Easter. Easter's not until the 17th. And then we have the May one. Um, this is the June one that we're doing a class the end of April. April the 30th, and I think May, to, May the 6th. It's on a Saturday. It's from 11 to 4. It's paper piecing. It's a 36 by 36, and if you've never paper pieced, this is the way to go. Jill was working on this one at home to get it done up so that you know. So don't think that when you come to class that we haven't prepped. You know, you prep hours before you come in so that you find out all the do's and don'ts. But uh, these are great. They run $49.99. And you say, well, I think it's too much. Well, I know. Everything's costly now, so suck it up, buttercup. You have to with whatever you do. We wanted to mention this is our last month. You can still order our monthly designs. They cost you $10 a piece if you see one online. Now, you won't get your free design unless you decide to join the Queen Bee Club. And you can join that. It runs $120. For the whole year and you get 12 designs that Jill, Lori, and I choose to give you, which is always nice, and the 12 which you have a Kimberbell account with this. So this is really cute. So this is it. I wanted to remind you. Today is March the 31st. So 
it's the end of the month. Yay. The next thing I want to talk to you about is I pulled a few of these out of our cell fabric. And I want to shout out to Kim Edens because you know this is the deal to die for. Our cell fabric until tonight at 11.59 is on sale at 40% off. All of our cell fabric is. And I just picked a few because there's collections back here. If you're thinking about doing a quilt and you feel that your budget with our regular price fabric won't let you, please visit our cell fabrics at 40% off. We have great fabric. We have moda, blanks, quilting treasures. So, you know, I know how good our fabric is. And this is a one-time thing that we're doing on our website. So you have to get on our website, purchase it, pick up in store. But please take advantage of the 40% sale on our cell fabric. So we wanted to show you that this this morning and remind you today is the last day. The next thing we want to show you, and uh, we will have more next week. Jill bought the last one. This Stitch Ripper. <laughs> it is wonderful. And you say, well, I don't ever have to pull out stitches in embroidery. You ain't done any embroidery at this point. But this, I just pulled this out. But what you do when you use this stitch ripper, it comes with, I have my other one floating around here. It comes with another piece. I might have laid this over top of it. I, right here. These are interchangeable if you got the wider one. This is wonderful for taking out hems, but you got to be careful. You can still tear fabric if you've got a tough hem because I've done it but what's nice about it with with this is you can go over a larger section can you move in a little closer Lori and I'm going to show the folks about the seam ripper everybody should have one of these they run $89.95 say I need to take this out because it doesn't look good so what you do is you always stay on the back side the, the best you can and if you want to start with small areas, you just take this right into your design. Now remember, if you don't keep it smooth like this, you can tear the fabric. But if you notice, look how that is just lifting that out. I mean, you just got to work it. You'll get a system. You know, put you some Kenny G on or Dolly Parton. Porter Wagner, Johnny Cash, and, you know, just get down in it. Just as country music listeners, get down in it. Or I get some Commodores on and think about how life was in the 70s and 80s. But you see how wonderful this tool is. I think this is the best tool that has come out. Uh, in the embroidery world, but it's also great for the sewing world. If you uh, do alterations such as I do, um, it works. It has a charger. Uh, this has got batteries, but you see, this came out, and then it's easier to, to lift these out. Look how easy that come out. Is that wonderful? So if you're doing a project or you're doing something, and... Uh, you don't want to be Christy and, you know, do it inside out. And you want to try to salvage it. This is the way. But you see, right there, I took all of that out with this little gadget. This is better than a sharp pair of scissors if you're in embroidery. And you just happen to mess up. So it comes with two different um, heads. And they're real easy to change. Um, of course, I'll struggle here this morning because I'm on camera. But um, I love this gadget. Uh, I can do this. you got to hold your mouth right when you're doing this. And I obviously am not. You have to turn the camera off. <laughs> Turn the camera off, but there it is with the wider. So if you're covering 
if you are removing a larger section, like if we was removing this, I always put my hand behind it as a support. So if you're using, doing a bigger section, or you wanted to take all this out. I just like that little pointy thing. Because I work with Lori and Jill, and those two are pickers, so you better, if you're going to hand something over to them that you've picked out, you better have it to the best that it can go. Now, sometimes I will go on the front if I feel I'm not getting anything and start to try to remove it from the front. I always have a pair of great tweez tweezers, a pair of small scissors, which I don't have on this morning because uh, I sewed until 9.30 last night on some alterations at home. But I love this tool. You know, it's not about selling it to you. It's just a great tool. And you say $89.99. Well, that's a good price if you buy a pair of trimmers. Trimmers, your trimmers out here uh, that you buy for trimming hair and stuff is not the same because of the adapters that comes. Um, you, you don't have the control of the speeds the way you do with these. Just so if you're thinking, I can go to Sally's and buy a pair. It's not the same, but, you know, some people, I don't know, don't want to give $89 to this tool. <laughs> it's one gold to me. So, I just wanted to share it with you. It means that much. And, of course, Jill Blizzard bought the last one online last night. I know we have four coming in next week, so watch our website. They will be up and running, but I couldn't help but not to show that. Betsy told me last week. When I talked to her, she says, well, you need to show that. So, I showed it, Betsy. Love the tool. <laughs> we wanted to show you that we've got 20 new petites. Uh, what's the name of these, Lori? They're Bermuda petites. So and they're, they're beautiful really colors. Colors. I just pulled three. I can't carry 20 of them. Because <laughs> Lori won't want to put them up. So, I wanted to share it with you this morning. Uh, so, it's a collection of 20 petites. We just got in some patriotic. I'm going to try to show you these. Lori will have these in today. We bought these to coordinate with our other um, patriotic uh, fabrics. And you know Memorial Day is coming and then July the 4th is coming. So we wanted to get you some new fabrics to pick from. So... Is I tear down everything. And our deals of the month is we're promoting this pillow. It's regularly $17.99. It works in this versus, you know. And if you don't want to do the pillow for a minute, that's, that's why we live in America. It's your choice. Um, what's nice about the, the poly down pillows. You might go to Walmart and buy one. But this has nice support. It's even foam in it. So it's a little different. And it gives you support. A lot of these cheap pillows that you buy, they just cave in. So I don't buy those. And these are great to do uh, memory quilts with if you've got a couple lined up. Um, and they do run $17.99. So with 25% off. You know, we've got plenty of those in. I wanted to share it with you. Um, Christmas is coming. I know it's just the beginning of April. But these are things that we got in. The American Star, these are real cute. You might go to our website and read up on the American Star quilt pattern. Um, these are great gift ideas. Now listen, you guys, you can't start Christmas gifts too early if you're going to make them. I see people start them in October and... Lord, they're stressed out by November. They don't enjoy Christmas because they're trying to get a quilt done. They're trying to do these little things like this. This is a great project for the summer months if you don't want to get into a heavy quilt. You know, doing what I mean by heavy is down in a king size quilt and it's got 654 pieces in it. <laughs> uh, these are great projects to keep your sewing ability going. Don't be a seasonal sewer, because if you are, you don't sew well. Bottom line. Um, and then we've got this trace marker. It has It's a seven-piece 
So I'd like for you to read up on this online. This runs $21.99. But this is a great tool for marketing to have. We've had this. This is put out uh, by the Magic Click company that puts out the, the new pens that has the blue and uh, pink grip where you can just pick it up like that because, you know, we're starting all to get that little bit of arthritis in our hands. But this is a great marketing um, tool to have in your notions in your selling room. So we wanted to show you that. This runs $21.99, like I said before, but you got 25% off. All right, for you gals out there that doesn't ever want, you know, the fabric that you didn't buy from the sewing gallery and it shreds or it frays, the pinking rotary cutting blade is the best. Or if you're that gal that makes prayer cloths a three by five, this keeps it from fraying uh, for the way that it cuts in and angles it. It's a great tool to have. So I wanted to throw that. I've got four items. We usually do three. But I wanted to just give those ones a touch of something a little different this year or this month. Uh, you know, uh, when you sew on prom dresses, you don't know what day it is either. And when you come up front, you can't find yourself either. And somebody wants to talk to you about a machine. And as all you've thought about is the glitter that's still in the bathroom from this dress here. It'll be here for another two months. <laughs> I started to take a few dresses home and I thought, oh God, I can't have glitter all over the house. My dog Lucy would get real mad. Because she told me that she doesn't like these dresses that... She doesn't want me working on stuff when I get home. But I did last night. But... The pinking blade is an excellent blade to use if you're cutting prayer cloths for your church. If you are one of those that doesn't like the fabric to fray at all when you have to press the seams open, this is a great gadget to have in your notions uh, in your sewing room. So we wanted to share it with you. We want to share uh, everybody that has helped us. I want to thank um, all of my volunteers that has helped me. And my friend Christy is down sunbathing in her two-piece at the beach, her and Rick. So I hope you're having a good time, Christy, packing in your two-piece bathing suit down there at the beach. I know you're on the beach getting that sand all over you. Yay for you. And I wanted to mention one more thing before I holler at everybody that watches us. We still have our deals, our brother deals go through... Uh, the 11th of April, um, if you check out our website, you will see, you can go through our whole catalog. Brother does it just so classy. None of the other companies can touch us. And I mean that. I, I just think the way that they uh, give you free stuff, we give you free stuff. Um, we've got all of our small machines in now, as of right now. So yay for us. Um, but thank you so much for watching us this morning. Doreen, you've been a blessing on the quilting machine. And Nancy, you've been a blessing with helping me get fabric picked out for the back of quilts, helping me find them, you know. Uh, and Christy, of course, uh, your extra support has been such a blessing uh, for all of you guys that's reached out. And of course, I don't want to leave out Debbie and Kathy, and Kathy is a new proud owner. She's got a new kid in the house. She's got a new baby puppy. She hasn't told us what the name is yet, but her and Debbie Morrison are the dog wardens. <laughs> uh, and I harass them all day, Friday and Saturday, about their cages because they cage train their dogs, And but Kathy and Debbie, uh, is my buddies, and uh, I told them all on Friday and Saturday that they all had to put on one of these dresses, and they got real mean about it, all of them in the class, but we had a wonderful two-day class in Bordry, uh, I think, and I feel that a lot of people got a lot of good things. It was a joy having you here, but all I could think about was all these prom dresses behind me of getting them done, but I know in time, and Jill says, We'll get them done, Sue. We'll get them done. Well, you know, when a dress comes in, I'm thinking, okay, what's my strategy to get this one done? So I just thank Jill, my good friend, uh, that has been a blessing in my life. 
you know, people will cross your path because that's who God chooses for you to cross with. Sometimes you don't understand it at the time, and sometimes it's to test your patience and just see really what uh, fruit you bear. So I just thank God for all the good people that he has sent my way, that's volunteered, that's helped me, and I really mean it from the bottom of my heart. So I want to holler at the patties, of course, my friend Kathy and Debbie, the dog people. Kathy, we need to know the name of that new dog, and you need to post a picture of it with the pee pad and a dog. Yay for us. And Christy down there at Myrtle Beach in her two-piece. And, of course, Betsy's supposed to be watching this morning. Is she watching this morning? I'm not sure. I haven't heard, but she, well, she's we're probably, hoping she she's is. She's probably in the bed. Uh, She'll watch Sheila, later. Sheila, our queen bee. Uh, and Tammy, Tammy Todd, uh, I don't know what to say about her this morning, but Joanne and my good buddy Doreen, quilt and buddy, and Teresa and Cindy, Nancy and Judy, um, and there's many more out there. And, of course, Juanita and Wayne and Virginia down in uh, Hinton. We thank you all. And I do have a little surprise, but you got to act tomorrow there is going to be an april fool something on our website that it's going to be for one day only so if you don't take advantage of whatever the one day april fool's day thing is it's on you but our sale ends today uh will not run a 40 percent off on our sale fabric again uh so i just wanted to share with you and Lori's saying something. She's got these We got Daisy Sue from Kathy Bolton. Oh, what day? Did you call that dog Sue because of me, Kathy? <laughs> Daisy Sue. <laughs> well, how cute. It's called Sue. That dog's going to be in my home, just like Rocky and this other little dog. Yay, <laughs> Kathy, you got a name. We want to see the dog as soon as possible. But thank you for coming and listening to me every Thursday morning at 930. I want to shout out to Mary for making her website wonderful, uh, covering Lori and I's tracks always. Thank you, Mary, uh, for being our web designer. And it's like you're right here in town with us, even though you're in Montana. Thank you. And thanks to all the folks who give this small business support. We love you. We appreciate you. And thanks for all my friends helping me volunteering. Uh, in the store while Betsy's gone. Have a great day.